welcome pisces i'm back y'all with another video so this is going to be uh, for the month of february i'm trying to keep up and do it weekly so we'll see how this goes all right so this is for the pisces sun moon and rising i've already saved these cores i already blessed them it is ready to talk okay so let's see what messages we got keep in mind guys that this message is going to be a general message so whatever comes out that's what um we're going to talk about okay it could be in regards to love money um career whatever we're going to talk about it all right so it was another circle and we're going to get into it All right, we got the two of cups here at the bottom of the deck. Oh, look at this. The queen of wands and the king of wands. Okay. Oh, the ace of wands too. So you look like you got a new start. I feel like something may have fell apart or something did not work. And it didn't work for a reason. It didn't work out for a reason, okay? So it looks like you have found your match or you will be finding your match. Okay, so let's see what's going on. We got the Fool, the Page of Swords, the Six of Cups, and the Hermit. So Pisces, it looks like you, you done fell all the way back from a situation. And now you're just observing. You're observing. Very, very observant. You have, you done took your hands off of it. You're not, you know, too close to the situation. You're watching from a distance. You don't like what it is that you see. You don't like what it is that you see. I feel like there's something that you're looking at and you're disgusted by it. Like, like something that you see, you just disgusted. It. It's just like, mm -mm, that's not it. Why is the four of cups here? Yeah, you don't want this. You don't want this anymore. That's, you don't feel all the way back from the situation because you don't want it no more. Yeah, see, the person that you was dealing with, they was too in and out. They was in too indecisive. It was too indecisive. Couldn't make up their mind what they wanted. So, yeah, you don't want it anymore. But I still feel like you look at it, you watch it from time to time. And the more and more you look at it, the more and more, it, you know, you, you fall back from a situation and you're looking at it from a different perspective. You're disgusted. You like, why did I want that? Why was that a part of my life? Like you no longer are interested in this individual. Yeah, you don't want to go back to the situation because you don't want to have no regrets either. And see this person that you're dealing with, they toxic. They got all type of secrets. They possess it. They could have some type of addictions. They could be on drugs or anything. Like, it's just something that's unhealthy. I don't feel like you want to be a part of that anymore. Yeah, see, you're having regrets. You regret that you even love this person. It's like, mm, I done gave them my love. I wish I wouldn't have. I wish that I wouldn't have. So you got a new energy coming in. This emperor here, this could be an Aries, or this is just somebody who carries and embodies the energy of the divine masculine. Okay, this is the energy of that you would be waiting for. Like, this is the energy of somebody that you would just be happy to be with, okay? And I feel like you never gave up on that. You knew your time was coming. Um, you kept you kept the faith, and you knew your time was coming. And here comes this masculine. He fine. 
she fine take it how it resonates um you get this new beginning but definitely the situation that you're that i feel like you're spying on this situation you're looking back at the situation it didn't work because spirit spirit had to come in see your ancestors had your back they knew that this situation wasn't no good for you Okay, you had to see this from a, from the outside looking in. You had to view this situation from the outside looking in because I feel like you wouldn't have never gave up on this person uh, had you not ever got this information, had you not ever been on the other side of the fence. This person could be a Virgo. You got the Hermit here. Yeah, you did some, I feel like you did some soul searching. I feel like you did some soul searching. I feel like you have grown so much. You have transitioned so much. You have blossomed so much. And to this empress who's waiting for her emperor or this emperor who's waiting for his empress. I feel like you're a match. Your match made in heaven is not the situation that you're looking back on. You need to let that situation, you know, expire out. I feel like a lot of you got new, brand new love coming. It's something fresh. It's something new. Um, this person is more of your, more on your level and is more so a match. Okay. I feel like you finally decided to stand up for yourself. Cause I feel like in the past you were uncertain about this connection. Um, yeah, see, you 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 finally decided to stand up for yourself. You finally decided to stand up for yourself, Pisces. I'm super super duper proud of you. Now, this two of swords energy lets me know in the past that you were at a crossroad. You were at a crossroad. I feel like. You would have gave this person another chance, but they would have had to make they would have had to make some changes. I feel like you were more open to um, allowing this energy back into your life. I feel like you were more open to you may have been open to that um, just simply because you're on the fence about it. So that further lets me know, like you feel you knew that you had a choice that you had to make. But you knew also, you felt like, you know, maybe this time it'll be different. Oh, it'll change our situation. It'll make us, the connection stronger. But now I feel like the more and more you look at this, you watch, you're watching this person. You're watching how this person move. You're watching the things that they're doing. It's like you're disgusted. You don't want to be in a relationship that you're going to regret. This is definitely an X because we got that Six of Cups energy up there. Yep. It, I told you Spirit stepped in. Okay. This connection fell apart because there's something, a brand new energy that's getting ready to enter your life. Some of y'all already got your new beginning. Some of y'all been waiting on y'all new beginning. It's here. <laughs> it's here. But this had to fall apart first. Yeah, see. You had to walk away from that first, or this person had to walk away from you. Whatever the case may be, it fell apart, okay? The fool is a new beginning, a new start. And see, this is giving you an opportunity to save more. Some of y'all may have been realizing that this person was draining your resources, draining your money. Um, you were busy trying to make the relationship seem like it was perfect, but in actuality, you may have been um you know drained financially you may have been feeling like um this person was taking more and you were giving more okay so you finally decided to stand up for yourself but i do see you watching this person like just kind of watching them. This is the King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. I feel like you're keeping your eye on this person. You're just keeping, you just, yeah, you're, you're watching to see what this person is talking about. Yeah, like, what what are they up to? What are they up to? You know? But the more and more, I'm telling you, the more and more you, it's like, ill. I don't want nothing like that. Mm-mm.
you got a lot of success. I'm hearing congratulations. I'm hearing job well done. You got a lot of success coming for you. It could be work-related, something that you're working on, something that you're building. I'm hearing congratulations. Yeah, look at this. The star. Oh, yes, Pisces. Pisces, something that you are working on is getting ready to pay off. Something that you've been working towards is getting ready to pay off. You're getting ready to be rewarded. Okay. Now this person, I feel like this person is holding you back, and slowing down, slowing you down. They didn't really see your potential. They know that they that um, they they messed up the relationship. Five of Swords and the Two of Cups. They know that they messed up this relationship. They know. <laughs> they know it. They know the part that they played in. It. Look at this. The, okay. See, in your hopes and fears, you feel like you deserve more. Okay? You're, you're very giving. I feel like you're very giving. But you're not going to be taken advantage of this time. You're not going to be being taken advantage of this time. You're hoping, I feel like in your hopes, you're hoping that you just receive more. You get more out of life, okay? You get more. Look, I see y'all been investing in something. Y'all been investing in something. Y'all are getting ready to see the fruits of your labor, Pisces. Get ready because blessings are getting ready to rain down on you, okay? And I feel like all these little rainy days, this Five of Pentacles energy of feeling unwanted or feeling unloved or feeling rejected, that shit is over with. It's done. It's done. Y'all got better days ahead. See, you know that that was a bad choice. You're just taking this as an L, okay? You're taking it as an L, and you just... Chucking it up and keeping it moving, okay? I feel like that's going to be the best thing for you. I feel like this person is holding you back. It's holding you back. I feel like a lot of y'all have regained your confidence. This situation has taught you a lot, okay? Now, you're letting this person, that, who, you're letting this person be in their mental prison, okay? While you are evolving, okay? You're evolving, I love it. Love to see it. Yeah, you're leaving this person stuck in their energy. Um, and, you know, I feel like there's, you had, you went through some type of awakening. I feel like you were sleeping at one point. But you realize, you realize what's, what's, what's what. Yep. You feel you realize that the situation is toxic and it's not going to work. That relationship is not going to work. Okay, this this person loves to take advantage of females. Okay, they don't really they look at females. This person looks at females as toys, as tools, as uh, ways to get ahead in life. This person is a narcissist. Okay, this person only cares about about him or herself. Okay, and I feel like you have woken up today. You've realized that 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 was that just wasn't a good choice. Okay, that wasn't a good choice. But the thing about it is, is I feel like you are coming out of that. Do you know how big this energy is? This is celebrity status. Okay, six of wands and a star. This is star status. This is star quality. You were this person didn't did not deserve your energy. I feel like you gave it a try and they tried you. Okay. Now, I feel like you, something that you've been investing in, you've been planting some type of seeds, okay? You done planted some type of seed. You done planted some type of seed here, okay? Get ready for your harvest. Get ready for your harvest. Six of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles. Get ready for your harvest, okay? I feel like some of y'all are have already invested. That's your new start. For some of you, it's love. That's your new start. For some of you, it's just straight up just self-love, loving yourself, being able to walk away from a situation that no longer served you. That is your new start. I love this reading for Pisces. This is a very, very, very good energy. Y'all know that we are um, still in the pre-shadow phases of Mercury retrograde. 
We have those two weeks periods before and after. So it's still kind of a shadow phase. But nonetheless, Mercury has gone direct. So it's time to get things moving. If there's been any delays, it's time to move forward. I feel like the more and more you look back at this situation, the more you, um, I feel like it's helping pushing you forward. If that's what you need to do to kind of look back and, you know, reflect, if that's what you need to do to move on, then so be it. But there's so much success for you in the near future, Pisces. All right. So I hope this message was helpful. I love it, love it, love it. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below, all right? I'm going to chat with my fellow Pisces later. Ciao.